Hi everyone and welcome to SheGo's YouTube channel. In this video I will show you how to split CSV automatically with SheetGo. By setting up an automated workflow, you can pull data from one CSV file and split it into multiple files. In one click or using automatic updates, your data is then distributed into different sheets, saving you time and effort in manually splitting and transferring large amounts of data. Let's say I have a CSV file full of every single customer order that my company had in the last three years. The sales team needs all the 2022 data in their personal Google Sheets files in order to analyze the results and create a report. Using the SheGo web app, I can split the data within my CSV file to create three new Google Sheets files that each contain the 2020, 2021 and 2022 orders. I can then share the spreadsheet with the 2022 order data with my sales team. Let me show you exactly how to do it with SheetGo. First we need to sign up for SheetGo and you can do that by using the link that I've put in the video description below. It takes us to this screen in the SheetGo web application where you can sign in with your Google, Microsoft or Dropbox account. Let me quickly sign in with Google. There we go, we enter my SheGo workspace where I have all of my workflows listed and here we can create a new one by clicking on new workflow. So let's do so. In the explore page you can search for specific components, features or solutions but we're just going to start from scratch by clicking create connection right here. SheGo automatically creates an untitled workflow for us which we can later rename. And the first step we need to do is select our data source. So where does our data come from? In our case, it is our CSV file, so we're going to select single file and search for our CSV inside our storage. Let me find it right here. We have our sales order CSV, so I've selected that one. Now what we need to do is press next to move on to the next step. And here we enter our process section. So where we want to process our data, in our case, we want to split the CSV file and set conditions to send this file to multiple locations. SheetGo loads the file columns, as you can see right here. And of course, we want to split this data based on the order date. So you select that column and simply press next. Then in the next step, we're going to choose a destination for this data. We want to send this data to multiple files. So you can either select multiple files separately right here, or you can already organize them inside a proper folder. So let's click files in a folder. And then you can choose it whether or not you want SheGo to create a new folder for you. For example, it could be that you already have an existing sales data folder in your drive. Then you can select it from here. You can also change your destination folder. For example, I want to create Google Sheets file. So I'm going to select Google Drive as my destination folder. There we go. Our data will now be distributed to Google Sheets files. We can get, rename the name of this folder, for example, sale sales orders per year and the destination tab can also have a new name order data for example we're going to press done and this is how our workflow looks like we bring the data from our csv file we're going to split it into multiple google sheets files in a folder let me click finish and save to save this split csv workflow there we go shigo has recreated the split let me open the folder for you to show you the results and there we go, SheGo has done exactly what we've asked for, what we expected. It created three new Google Sheets files in this folder, one for 2020, for 2021 and 2022 sales orders. Let me open this file and show you. That's it. Here you can see that SheGo successfully did the split and we brought only the data from the 2021 customer orders into our spreadsheet here. Let me go back to SheGo and open the workflow overview for you where we can rename, for example, sales order management as the workflow name. You can also see who is the owner of this workflow and, and who has access to the files. And of course, you can open the share settings to add your colleagues and team members. And you can choose whether or not you want to give them added access to the files inside the workflow as well. Simply click done to finish this. You see how many files and connections there are in this workflow. So we have two files, the sales order CSV file and the folder. And we have one split connection in between them. Then we see when the workflow last runs, so it was one minute ago, 
but we haven't set our automatic update schedule yet. So we're going to click on schedule settings and turn on the automatic updates to run, for example, once a day, multiple times a day or once a month. Let me do once a day between 8 and 9 a.m. And you can turn it off on the days that you don't need the workflow to run. For example, I only want to set it to run on every Monday morning. Click save to schedule automatic updates. There we go. That's how you split CSV into multiple files with Chico. If you have any questions about this, please do not hesitate to comment below. And make sure to like this video if you've enjoyed it and subscribe to our channel for more Chico how-tos and automation tips and tricks. Thank you very much.